Hello guys, welcome back. LFC Lazarus here. We are on part 8 of title domination. Before I start, I want to say sorry about... It's been a week and a day now. It's been 8 days. Uh, I've been really, really busy. If any of you the subscribers on my normal channel, I haven't uploaded anything on there for ages. Uh, things have been a bit hectic recently with work and... All sorts, really, man. But uh, yeah, I'm back now. It will be right here now. I mean, I have started playing FM again, so... Everything's good, not running out of time. So, let's start part 8. Uh, change up a bit again, really. I mean, I really want to see what the fixtures, what results i got. Um, it's been a hard season so far. Uh, I mean, the results don't exactly show that. I mean, the 2 1 loss to City was close. We've been destroying teams that we should be destroying, which is nice to see, but. Uh, Everton, we lost 3-1, we got absolutely demolished there now, I'll show you that game in a bit, but um, as you can see, we we are getting comfortable wins, but it's just been a difficult season with uh, injuries and combating against them. Uh, obviously, the group there we are, we did come top of the group by, I think it was like two goals or something. Uh, we lost to Vence, yeah, I was not happy then, because we, we, we should have done better than we were. Uh, again, the lost to United, we... we, we and we, I wanted to be winning these. I mean, this is the season where I wanted to dominate everything, like in this, 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 this league. But it's just not happening. I mean, as you can see, one-one to Villa, Blackburn, then Villa again. It's not good enough. Not good enough at all. Um, lost to young boys who I didn't rate at all. I mean, well, you just seen before we did beat them three-one at home, but it just shows that away we aren't exactly firing all cylinders yet. Uh. There, the League Cup semi finals, as you can see at the top there, 2 0 at home at Chelsea. Then we lost 1 0 away. I really thought we were going to win both of those, like, both legs, because um, we were, well, I thought the confidence we'd get from the 2 0 and then the 3 0 and the 4 0 would just, like, put us over the top, but it just didn't. It's unfortunate, I suppose, but, um, you know, we got <laughs> we're in the League Cup final again, what can I say? We might as well live there. Uh, but yeah, I'll take the league now. It's looking positive. I mean, considering I didn't really think I was doing that well, like I never really checked the league when I'm playing. I just go through the games, and I wasn't exactly looking forward to this update. I mean, I didn't think we'd be doing that well, but it's nice to see that we're clear. We are three points clear, which is good. But obviously, Chelsea can catch us up quite easily. But it's nice. I mean, it's really, really weird there. I mean. Liverpool fifth, Fulham sixth, Everton seventh. It's it's a it's a quite a nice uh, to have the tail to be honest with you. I mean there's Leeds, my Leeds there, eleventh. Uh, their job came up, I was gonna take it, I thought, nah nah, I can't I need to need to win the Champions League first. So there's that. Uh looking positive, I mean second half of the season we normally are stronger towards the end of the season, so I'm looking forward to it. Uh next we will be at the Everton game. See, Van Persie got injured in the 27th minute. We never ever look like getting into it. I mean, Milner's goal was merely a consolation. We didn't we didn't play well at all. Um, that guy there that's going in the 40th minute. That guy there, that's his new name. I don't know how to say his name. Do you mercy? Do you do you mercy Bocani? He's actually an absolute demon. Uh, he's he was ban he's been banging him in all season so. Be interesting to see how he does. I mean, maybe if I leave and go to another country, you can you can come with me. Because I don't think I'll be able to bring any of these Arsenal players. I mean, the rate the, the value is going up because I'm doing so so well. Uh, but there you go, League Cup Sunday the second of March. We're there again. Arsenal v West Ham. I think I'm going to say another League Cup's coming at the Emirates because West Ham are near enough bottom of the league. I think I think they're 18th, but two points off bottom. I am I'm quite happy in saying we're going to win this one. I mean, we are the stronger side, and this is our cup, so no worries there. FA Cup, Liverpool. These I think these knocked us out last year, didn't they? I think it was Liverpool that knocked us out. So obviously that is the next game. Oh, that's today. That is <laughs> that is the next game I will be playing my game. Uh, probably should have. Whack that in this one, but you know I'm sorry about that. You have to wait. You have to wait to find out. Uh, Liverpool, Arsenal away. Not looking forward to this one. They are a good club, but we aren't away. 
if it was at, if it was at the Emirates, I think we'd hammer them, but just unfortunate, really. Champions League now, and as you can see, we have this time got through to the first leg. Um, varied teams. I mean, Rapid Bucharest didn't really rate them. Don't really rate Sparta Prague. We're really against, to be honest with you. But uh, obviously, Genoa, Genoa, who are in our group, have Seville, who I think are really good teams. So I'm, I'm surprised that that there is like three from England and Spain. Because usually Man United did actually flop last year, and so did Tottenham. Actually, no, Tottenham in the Euro Cup was last year, so obviously Arsenal and Tottenham <laughs> keeping it North London in the competition. Um, yeah, I think it's it's very very winnable. I'm confident in saying that the only teams we we could struggle with are Real Madrid and Barcelona, which is obvious. I think any, I think we will overpower any other team we play against. This, I mean, there's no other big teams. Marseille, who we beat in the Europa League final. Uh, but yeah, that's it for that. But I think that is that is very winnable this season, which I look forward to um, taking part in it when it comes up on the 26th of February. Here is the World Player of the Year award, and as you can see, Mario Mandzukic of Arsenal just missed out. Uh, he, he, I, 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 I always say this when he wins something. I don't see how he gets these. He isn't a regular player. Uh, I mean, F Fierro, Shamak now, and Van Persie knock him out of the team every time. I have to put him in as a sub. And even then, it doesn't look like he's doing a lot. But, um, I don't know. I mean, good on, good on him. Good on him winning it. But it's a bit weird, the fact that he's winning it. when he's not exactly getting a lot of game time. And that's it for this mid-season update. Uh, it has been a quick one. I mean... I have put some really long videos out recently, and I have rewatched a few of them. And they drag on. And I just wanted to get this one out there straight away. Try not make it too long. Uh, I think I might have now. I can't actually know. But actually, know. I'm sorry if it's too long for you guys. Uh, I want to see some comments. What you all think? Head over to my channel. There will be some more videos over the next few days. There probably won't be one. There will be one tonight. I think, which would be on Rochdale Cream mode. I'm looking to do some more stuff like maybe. I want to get my pro clubs in here because I think it's just really good fun. Like me and my friends do have a lot of fun in it because we just take the piss out of each other. So you know. But anyway, comment on the video. I will really reply to you. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay safe. LFC Lazar out.